Uh, we just we just looked at button press and showed some video game footage of it. And we showed you the drill where we're just teaching the concepts. Now let's take the drill to the next level. Let's let's read whether it's a stock block or a pass. And a stock block, let's get off side, get you know, do all the button press elements that we talked about, and then incorporate a running back or ball carrier and a finish to it. We call that cowboy drill. How we set it up is you have uh, the corner, uh, you have a receiver, and we have a ball carrier, all right? And that receiver is going to run at this corner, shimmy down, and stock block him with the ball carrier coming. Or we'll mix it up so that corner doesn't cheat, and you'll see it on video clip. He's going to run around, okay, where that corner will have to open up. Just to keep him a little, I like to throw that element in, just to keep them a little honest in this drill so they're not just coming flying downhill right now and cheating the drill. I don't want drill players. I want to teach the concepts they're going to see on Friday night. So we're going to, let's take a look at cowboy drill. Here's cowboy drill we just drew up and talked about it, adding that tackle element to our button press technique. We want to not dance with that guy, get past him, and then tackle him. All we tell our defensive backs and all our players are, as we get closer to that ball carrier, shimmy down. We're going to shimmy our feet. That's shorten our stride. The down part's our hips. We're going to put our face and chest on his, club up, wrap up, eyes up, speed up our feet, and finish. It's a nice job. Shimmy's down, puts his chest on him, speeds his feet, finishes. Okay, cowboy drill. So we're going to shuffle out. We're going to read that release. He's throttling down. Button press, violent hands. I'll change it up. One day I'll say we got to fit outside. Next time I'll say we're going to rip across inside his face like the ball's declared inside. Okay, this old footage here is ripping across. Does a great job having violent hands. Keeping his separation as he works across his face and does a great job of chesting him up and finishing down. Here's that receiver element, the route element I talked about. See this corner cheating the drill? Throw this one in every three or four times. So that guy's not just taking a couple token shuffles back and getting downhill. He's actually reading this receiver, okay? He's wrong here. Oh, you know, his hip, bad thrown ball. He gets the pick, gets rewarded, all right? But he was wrong-footed. 